The Kangaroos took to the training paddock for the first time since landing on foreign soil on Tuesday morning. With still over a week until the opening game of the World Cup against England, the coaching staff are mindful to ease the players into the campaign. Coach Tim Sheen says today was aimed at blowing out the cobwebs after the long flight. Lots of travel, lots of sore backs and you know, a long, long season for many of them. You know, again, we've just got to be careful to make sure we build it up and not, uh, not peak too early. The session was a mix of fitness and ball skills, with Jonathan Thurston looking sharp and in a jovial mood. The 5'8 says the key to this campaign is knowing when to switch on. Uh, by the weekend we should be uh, looking to uh, pick our standards up and, and making sure that you know training's uh, a lot more intense than what it was today and, and just keep building on that through the week. After a typical wet and windy welcoming to England, the players need to adjust to the slippery conditions. A lot of the boys have been here before and played uh, in these conditions, so uh, they've got the right footwear, they know what it's like, and um, you know over the next few weeks uh, they'll, they'll certainly enjoy it, but yeah, it's just about adapting to the conditions. The Kangaroos will have a full contact game simulation on Saturday, with Sheens and the coaching staff set to travel to watch their opponents play Italy in a warm-up fixture. I'll put a pair of sunglasses on and go and sit in the crowd somewhere. No, we're, we're planning to go out and have a bit of a look. Um, mind you, I, they're not going to—they're not going to show much. I think they're just using it as a hit out, as are most of the sides. In Manchester, Andrew Brown reporting for the Kangaroos.